A deep-sea submersible carrying five people on a voyage to the century-old wreck of the Titanic was found in pieces from a catastrophic implosion that killed everyone aboard the U.S. Coast Guard said on Thursday, ending a multinational five-day search for the vessel. A robotic diving vehicle deployed from a Canadian ship discovered a debris field from a submersible Titan on Thursday morning on the seabed some 1,600 feet or 488 meters from the bow of the Titanic, two and a half miles or four kilometers beneath the surface in a remote corner of the North Atlantic, U.S. Coast Guard Rear Admiral John Mauger said. This morning, an ROV or remote-operated vehicle from the vessel Horizon Arctic discovered the tail cone of the Titan submersible approximately 1,600 feet from the bow of the Titanic on the seafloor. The ROV subsequently found additional debris. In consultation with experts from within the Unified Command, the debris is consistent with the catastrophic loss of the pressure chamber. Upon this determination, we immediately notified the families. The Titan operated by the US-based company Ocean Gate Expedition had been missing since it lost contact with its surface support ship on Sunday morning, about an hour, which is a 45 minutes into what should have been a two-hour dive to the world's famous shipwreck. Coast Guard officials said five major fragments of the 22-foot or 6.7-meter Titan were located in the debris field left from its disintegration, including the vessel's tail cone and two sections of the pressure hull. And there was no mention was made of whether human remains were sighted.